everybody, Sarah and Gabriel here. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> We're here to tell you all about Gabriel's seven month update. So keep watching if you want to see more. So when Jacob talked to you all yesterday, he called it a bump date, which made me laugh because every week while I was pregnant, we would take a picture of my ever increasing belly and he would call it, we called it the bump date. So in the video yesterday, he said we were going to post our seven month Gabriel bump date, but we're not pregnant anymore. We have a seven month old now. So Gabriel is seven months old today, um, six months adjusted because he was actually born a month early. So they say you're supposed to adjust the age, but seven months since he was born and a lot has happened. So every month I post his update on Instagram with a bunch of little cute pictures and all of his different things. So I thought now that we have this lovely little YouTube channel that I would do it in a video so you can actually see the stuff I'm talking about. <laughs> you can see that he's sitting up really well. I'm only supporting him a little bit. He's still not like getting into the sitting position all on his own, but he is staying upright for long periods of time. He is not really crawling or army crawling or anything. He scoots around on his stomach, but he really only goes backwards. He has not figured out forward momentum yet. Uh, he knows how to spin around, so we'll put him down and he'll make a full circle and spin around. <laughs> so he's still not technically teething. There's no teeth yet, but he is drooling and chewing on everything and the gums are definitely swollen and we can see two little white teeth underneath the surface on the bottom so we just are waiting for those to break through sometimes he seems a little fussier than normal and so we think that might be teething but we don't know we started solid foods he's had rice cereal He's had bananas and he's had avocados and we mix all those with breast milk to try to keep a taste similar to what he's used to. He likes the rice cereal. He liked the bananas. He didn't really like the avocado. I don't know if, I think he might have a thing with temperatures because every time we give him something cold, he doesn't care for that as much, and the avocado was cold each time, so I think that might be why. More like avocado. No. That was a terrible dad joke. <laughs> dad joke. Hashtag dad joke. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna give him sweet potato tonight. We're gonna see what he thinks about that, so that'll be fun. We'll shoot some of that so you can see it too. Um, sleeping wise. He kind of regressed a little bit. He was doing really good there for a while. Excuse you. And he was going like uh, six hour stretches, which was awesome for us. But then he kind of went back to every two to three hours, which it felt like he was a newborn again. And that was not fun. Yeah. Hi. No. What do you do when you can't have that? Uh, but the last couple nights he's given us good four hour stretches. Uh, we did have some trouble with when he would get up, he would fall asleep while he was nursing, but then when we try to put him back in his bed, he'd wake up and be up for a couple hours, which was not fun for mm. mommy. Um, he's still not sleeping mm. fully in his crib. Mm. He sleeps part of the night in his crib and then the, the bulk of the night in bed with us. And then in the mornings, we put him back in his crib while I get ready for work and Jacob gets ready for the day. But he's not fully in his crib yet. I'm just not ready to let him go. Because I don't see him during the day, it's nice to have him there next to me at night. I can roll over and look at him and hear his cute little baby noises. Yes. But he is 20 pounds and 6 ounces. This is a little chunk. So everything you read says that your baby is supposed to triple their birth weight by their first birthday. And that would be 21 pounds for him because he was 7 pounds when he was born. And he's 20 pounds right now. So he is going to triple his birth weight when he's probably 8 months old. So we're going to have a little big baby. 
He, we don't think he's gotten too much longer yet, so he's still a little, he's still a little short. Hoping, hoping he gets some some length soon. A couple of his loves. He still likes his bouncer, and he loves to go to town in there. It's really funny to watch. He really likes clapping. When you clap at him, he thinks it is so funny, and he will just laugh and smile. He also really loves to watch children or other younger people. He is fascinated by them, and he will just be entertained by them for as long as they're around. As for dislikes, he's a pretty easygoing kid. He doesn't really not like much. He really does not like when we put him in his car seat initially. He will like... <laughs> bow up his little chest and make it really hard to buckle the straps. But then once you get him in there and get him secure, uh, he's fine. But the act uh, of getting into his car seat, uh, he does not like. Uh, <laughs> the other thing he doesn't like is when he is on his stomach and he's, you can tell he's trying to crawl and move and reach the toys that are around him. He gets really frustrated that he can't get to them. His little mind can't figure out how to get towards his toys. And you can really see the frustration. And it's kind of funny to watch, but you can tell that he is frustrated. So that's about all for Gabriel's seven months of life update. We will do another one of these when he turns eight months, which will be exciting. And I think we're gonna go try and give him some sweet potato. See how he feels about it. Ah! Are you ready to try some sweet potato? Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> how is that? How is that? <laughs> I love your faces. <laughs> Look at he's looking for you. What you think, buddy? You like your sweet taters. So sweet potatoes seem to be a success. Thank you for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe to our channel to see more. See more first foods. And tell us in the comments what you think. What food should we try next? See you later. <laughs>